Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode. This is a good one. As you saw, electric scooters are becoming more and more popular. Here are a few cool ones to take in consideration. Let's get started. Inu Scooter Israeli engineers have created another foldable electric scooter that takes up very little room. The new scooter is small and portable, with a remote-controlled folding mechanism. According to the creators, the car has state-of-the-art electronics in use, supports Bluetooth Wi-Fi, can accept phone calls, and, of course, this GPS. This car satisfies the greatest service and safety standards, and it can also entertain the owner and keep them in contact while on the road. The 750 watt electric engine enables for speeds of up to 15 and a half miles per hour. And the trip range ranges from 12 and a half to 25 miles depending on the rider's weight and riding mode. The price range begins at $3,000. Lampuganair the next vehicle on our list today may provide you with countless hours of pleasure on the lake. It is a convenient and simple to keep inflatable jet board. The design is made up of two parts, an inflatable component that keeps the border afloat and a plastic part that holds a 14 horsepower engine. The former is inflated with a normal pump and rolled up into a compact roller when transported. The second section is small enough to fit in the trunk of a vehicle, for example, the Lamp Yogan Air is a vehicle that is appropriate for individuals of all ages and physical abilities. It will allow you to go at speeds of up to 31 miles per hour on the water. Children takes around 2 hours to complete, and a full battery provides you 45 minutes of riding time. The cost is around $13,000. Flyboard Air Not all of today's inventions are available for purchase. Some of the models are so expensive that they become a source of interest, and people only hire them for a limited period of time. This, however, does not make them any worse or more dull. The Flyboard Air is one of the world's first jet-powered hoverboards, rising into the air using jet propulsion. Before takeoff, no specific preparation or substantial training is necessary. A 5 minute introduction before to the first flight is all that is required. The only stipulation is that the area you fly over be at least 5 feet deep. The flyboard area is a top speed of 124 miles per hour. A continuous flying duration of up to 10 minutes is provided by 5 turbines. Go to A scooter that may easily be the world's most capable personal vehicle. When folded, it creates a tiny tube that is 29.3 inches long and 5.4 inches wide. It fits nicely into the case with a handle. The nominal weight of 12.8 pounds makes it convenient to keep in travel. In terms of performance, you won't be disappointed, especially given that the model debuted more than 4 years ago. It has a 7.4 mile range and a peak speed of 10 miles per hour. A full charge takes 2 hours, with a suggested retail price of Lux LX It's no surprise that the creators of this vehicle claim it's the quickest, most dependable, and extreme rain longboard on the market. As well as an electric 2-in-1 vehicle. The Lux LX's secret is its changing design. A longboard's wheels may be exchanged in a single action, making it appropriate for riding both on and off-road. In its default setup, the model has 3.8 inch wheels. 
the off-road variant has an 8-inch wheel size. Pneumatic tires offer improved traction and mound clearance. The highest speed is 30 miles per hour. And the range is around 19 to 25 miles depending on riding circumstances. The entire set will run you back at least $13,100. Micro Luggage 3.0 The Boy Team Kit Pack is a gadget that combines the capabilities of two objects, a backpack and a scooter, into one. They don't interfere with each other at all when they're in use. The backpack has a capacity of 26 liters at the most recent count. There are many pockets on the inside for paperwork, tablets, and other critical little stuff. Because of the unusual folding design, the wheels do not collect dust on your clothes when you use the backpack while on the go. The backpack is firmly connected to the steering column and costs around $300. Ruder City Kokwari 04M1 Here's a vehicle that appears to have been designed for those who want to buy a motorbike but are frightened to do so. Okay, so for me, it's an electric scooter that appears to be a more serious vehicle. In just to varied road conditions, it's suitable for the city and suburbs, and continues to move even when there is a 30 degree slope. The maximum speed is 28 miles per hour. The range on the other hand is 18 and a half miles. Splats Transformer Splotch is set out to create an entirely new scooter for those who live an active lifestyle and enjoy extreme activities. The Transformer, 2020's latest creation, is an electric scooter with motorcycle capability. A 960 watt electric motor is located on the back tire. This enables the Transformer to achieve a peak speed of 24 miles per hour in 4 to 6 seconds. But it isn't all. The Transformer can climb slopes of up to 16 degrees. Disc brakes and suspension on all four wheels are further significant characteristics. The scooter is equipped with hydraulic suspension in the front and spring suspension in the back. The wheels are also replaceable, allowing you to go on or off-road. The procedure begins at 1100. We've had FS. A bold and aggressive appearance. High-grade aluminum alloy. A whole lighting system and stunning speed are just a few of the features of this electric scooter from the South Korean company we've had. It's a genuinely stunning scooter, with every feature catching the eye. First and foremost, the vehicle is notable for its foldable design. When folded, the WePad F's does not resemble a scooter. Furthermore, the cars have a broad footrest and a rounded steering stamp. It has a high-quality DNM suspension instead of conventional springs or air shocks. The 7.8-inch travel of these air oil shock absorbers enhances both riding comfort and off-road performance. A single charge provides a range of 74.5 miles. Finally, the highest speed is 74.5 miles per hour. Which is the most essential feature. That's lightning fast. As a result, in certain nations, the speed of the scooter must be limited. Overall, this is a model that many people will find worthwhile to pay $9,000 for. That was it for this episode guys. I really appreciate you for watching my show, and I hope you're all doing well. Till next time all the love and all the power. XR3 out.